So today we're gonna be playing WRC Roblox Rally. This is one of the best rally games on Roblox. And a few weeks ago, it got some very big updates that we will be checking out today. Like this Game Pass car right here that we might buy. But I'm confused about the name of the game because I'm pretty sure WRC stands for World Rally Championship. But why is there rally in the name twice? Like is the game called World Rally Championship or Roblox Rally? Maybe they put the rally in there just so it comes up in search but you can see the game currently has two game passes and from what i've heard they are pay to win so i'm gonna be comparing them to the 2021 models of those cars in the game to see which ones are quicker i really like this new menu they have in the game right now they say single player is an in development so i wonder what that's gonna be like maybe just time trial but alone and let's go into multiplayer and let's actually join you can see all the tracks they have right here there's three tracks in development and sweden was recently added and a couple more were recently added as well but since the f1 race this week is in monza i'm gonna be trying out monza i actually never knew monza had a rally circuit until i saw it in this game oh my goodness there this server is so full there's so many people here in monza and you can see how much time people have played apparently this person played for 2000 minutes that's more than 30 hours oh my goodness gets a life but let's go spawn a car so you can see we have the ford fiesta and the hyundai i20 both of them are and and this toyota yaris all of them are like 2021 rally cars and if we go here we find the 2022 versions which are game pass cars so let's use the ford because the game pass one has red bull logos and i am a red bull fan i'm not gonna lie these car models look very sick if they made the car model themselves they've done a great job props to them the cars look absolutely sick and it's a shame that i don't drive in third person because i am not gonna be able to see a car but anyways let's get ready to drive this looks like a tricky circuit so i'm gonna do two tries and pick the best time and there you go it's green so let's go Ooh, it's a very tight hairpin right here i don't like hairpins why are there so many hairpins okay left hander oh my goodness this is such a complicated track where's the rally part i'm looking for off-road and stuff okay we seem to be in the clear where do i go to the right hand oh my god this subaru is lagging okay there you go we're out of the trenches and the difficult part i think and there's another hairpin oh my god oh my god the entire track is just hairpins what is going on at monza why are there so many hairpins not even the f1 track has this many hairpins but that felt like nice so far and i'm pretty sure this is the monza straight let's be careful it's the chicane oh my god i crashed well i lost about two seconds from the chicane right there we might take that into account oh this is ascari but in reverse oh i got a corner cut rip why are we doing a monza in reverse this is so confusing oh my god it's so bumpy no the elevation change is so bumpy why is there wait oh my god there was some other person going the other way oh that person confused me okay we're going on to the dirt we're going left am i supposed to like come back backwards is that why there were people there Ooh, oh my god where am i i'm literally in the middle of nowhere am i getting kidnapped oh uh, and i went in oh no i'm um, oh no oh my god how did i not get stuck there this is like a tracker review honestly i never knew like the monza rally circuit was like next to the f1 track that's very sick i guess so maybe when we're gonna be watching the f1 race this weekend we're gonna be able to see where the rally circuit goes and this car is like decent it's not the greatest car ever it has decent handling but the power is like compared to group b cars the power is non-existent and there is the finish we set a two minutes 21 second lap time i'm pretty sure that's a horrible lap time i've seen people set like 158 so i'm pretty sure the current fastest time in the server is a two minute flat which means that like the actual best time is like a one minute 45 second but now that we've tried the ford fiesta we should try the ford puma and let's see it says do you want to buy a game pass it's only 75 robux so considering usual roblox racing game passes this is quite cheap let's see can i spawn it yes sir there is my car please close the menu oh my goodness this car looks so sick i, I don't like the how the light bulbs thingy look they're kind of bubbly or whatever but other than that the car looks very sick is that the original red bull logo it looks kind of weird but let's actually drive it now and see the difference oh 
my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. There's so much more power in this. I'm not sure if the handling is better, but the power. Oh, it's like double the power at this point. What the heck? Oh my god. It's so hard to drive because of the power. It's so hard to drive because of the power. I'm probably gonna drive better because I've had practice on the track now. But let's consider I lost like five seconds total from mistakes. So my time would be a 2 minutes 16 second lap time. And let's see what kind of time I can set with this. I'm pretty sure crashing into that chicane and then going through it is quicker than breaking for it and losing time on the straight. Let's not get a corner cut this time. Nice. Going through reverse Ascari. I mean, would Monza be nice if, if like the F1 cars did it in reverse? I'm not sure. It sounds like a good idea. But some corners would be completely meaningless. Like the first chicane would be so confusing like it would be quicker for the first part and it would be so much slower for the second part instead of the other way around which wouldn't make sense Ooh, this is a high speed left hander ah Oh my, oh my, oh, oh my god. Um, I, I've officially broken the car. I, this game doesn't even have damage and I broke one of my tires. What the heck? The red light says there's 15 seconds left. I'm not gonna wait that long. And let's see this time if we can drift through some corners because I know like Rally is known for drifting. So let's try to drift whenever we can. I mean, this car has way too good of a traction to actually drift anywhere. Maybe in the dirt. Usually the cars that drift the most in this game are like the group B rally cars like the Audi Quattro and the other group B car I can't remember what the name of it was but if you want to do some sick drifts those are the cars you want to try oh my god we're going 140 miles per hour oh there is a crash Hyundai right there okay there you go we made it through the chicane for the first time without actually crashing into it which is honestly a surprise and let's not cut this why is the rear so slidey like I have worn out rear tires already i guess it's just because these cars don't have traction control which completely makes sense and let's avoid getting damaged again oh my god this is so tight why is there a house in the middle of monza do people live in the inside of monza what the heck honestly i wouldn't be surprised if that's the case i mean emila has houses next to it doesn't it and let's avoid getting completely dnf'd here again oh break oh my god so much rear lock or something but that was clean there was no drift but it looked very quick and let's go through this right hander going on the uphill i'm pretty sure i'm close to the finish now oh there is a suck skoda there can we make it can we do a good time there is the finish and we set a two minutes oh five that's like 10 seconds quicker i said like the time we're gonna consider for the other car is a two minute 16 we just did a two minute five second no this can't be real okay i'm gonna spawn the ford fiesta again and compare so we did a two minute five second lap time this can't be an accurate representation because i had no practice in the in this car in the first run so i just want to try this one more time oh wow this car is like 16 miles per hour slower in terms of top speed and there you go i'm about to finish this lap in this car this is a better oh my god i was a second quicker than the game pass car i'm not gonna lie the normal car has way more understeer and less power Power, and I guess that makes it easier to drive but it's definitely not quicker in the longer run also I'm confused to why so many people drive on this track in reverse like why are there so many people driving backwards it kind of distracts you when you're on your lap and doesn't let you see what's going on but now I think it's time for a group B car so these three are group B cars and I think I'm gonna go for the most famous one which is the Audi Quattro and this looks absolutely sick what a beautiful beautiful car let's see what kind of time we can set in this car oh my god the hood is so long oh my god there's so much power in this car this has to be the most powerful car in the game and it drives very well so far i'm like controlling it oh my god the power though is insane i wonder what the top speed is gonna be if we even reach it on the straight here oh there you go we made it through the hairpins the engine sound for this car is absolutely insane as well oh my god we didn't even reach the top speed before reaching the chicane i had to break there because i was scared of crashing this is like one of the hardest cars in the game especially on the dirt circuits but if you can set like a very good lap with it 
you're gonna be like one of the fastest times for sure oh you don't want to crash here i've crashed there so many times today already there you go we're through a checkpoint i believe oh my god this is my fastest lap ever oh no 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 okay i crashed there but it's fine i don't think i lost too much time oh my god why is the hairpin so tight with these like when the cars are so big and the track is so tight it's so hard to drive oh my god you don't want to crash here you don't want to crash there you go i wonder if what happens if you like just avoid those chickens and go wide i mean can't i just do that is that quicker ah i just i didn't drift i i almost spun but thankfully it was a hairpin so spinning there didn't lose me too much time let's go through here okay we're getting close to the end and this is like a sub two this is this must be a purple time this is sub two minutes let's see what time do we set two minutes one second four tenths time i was gonna lie i expected it to be way quicker than that but but still a two minute one second lap time for someone who doesn't even play a rally that much this guy just set a 153 by the way so i guess like the real record is like a 145 maybe a 140 so i'm nowhere near that but you can see the times so the group b car was so much harder to drive but it felt so much quicker i guess maybe this ga other game pass car is quicker but if you want me to spend more robux in this game smash that like button and like, leave a comment down below and i honestly think that's it for this video if you want to see a video where i played another rally game that's paid access and has so many cool features click the video that pops up right now and i see you guys next time goodbye